<laughs> so one of the other ideas that's been suggested that sharks might be able to use their electroreceptors to navigate as well within the Earth's magnetic field. And here's how it would work. You know that the Earth has magnetic field lines running from the North Pole to the South Pole. Mm -hmm. And as a shark swims through those magnetic field lines, it's inducing an electric field around its head right. that informs it whether it's heading north, south, east, or west. And the sharks might be able to use that to help them navigate within the Earth's And they're able to do field. that across like oceans, right? It's, it's so interesting. You can look at tracks of some of these mm -hmm. sharks. They're moving beautiful straight line tracks in open ocean where there's no other cues. It's not visual, there's nothing to smell. It's just open ocean, but they're still able to maintain these beautiful straight line tracks, probably just by keeping themselves oriented using the Earth's magnetic field. It just blows my mind. I mean, does the moon come into this in any way? Well, here's what's interesting. You know, on either side of the full moon, the Earth's magnetic field is impacted by about 8% in just the span of a few days. And so with the Earth's magnetic field being altered by that much, it can really have an impact on things that are migrating as a result of that and relying on the Earth's magnetic field in order to maintain their heading. Completely amazing. Yeah.